so hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel thank you for the 10,000 subscribers remember i promised you guys that i'm going to do a try on haul of the stuff i went to buy in gikomba and kamkunji let me tell you do you know i went to gikomba and to kamkunji the same day i know gikomba and kamkunji are near but the fact that Kuenda kutafuta ngo, the way it's so sunny outside. So I remember I promised you guys that I'm going to do a try on haul of the things I bought. And those are not my things, point of correction. Those are one of my concierge services work job. A friend of my, uh, one of my clients sent me money. She wanted me to buy the, the stuff and then we delivered them. I delivered them to the mother because she was buying for the mother. So let me show you where, mm, what types of the type of thing the oh let me show you what i bought in both gikomba and kampunji i know i'm rambling i'm so happy after reaching 10,000 subscribers is not a joke let me tell you every milestone be it slow or fast it's a milestone for me like i really don't take you guys for granted for subscribing to my channel and for those who have subscribed just know that my channel is full of positivity so First thing first, let me show you what I bought. And I I think I did some short clips in Gikomba. Huh? Yeah, I did some short short mini clips in Gikomba because I was alone and I can keep up with It's like in a place kama Gikomba, you just fear vlogging. You know, like, like as if someone is going to, to, to grab your phone or to grab your money. And you know that mind you. That day there was a lot of people. I think it's because of back to school. Because uh, I think uh, children are going to open their schools on the that next month, next week. So I think that's why people were so you know, parents were so happy. And I had, I had gone in the morning. In the morning is the, the time people go and buy stuff and then they come and resell them camera. We got them in the thrifting. Una, you just pick camera close and then you go and sell. So let me show you what I bought shortly. So first thing first, let me show you what I bought, guys. Uh, I know. Let me, let me just echo uh, you. This one is a duvet cover. This is a duvet cover. Duvet cover is a duvet cover. duvet so that you don't get to clean to wash your duvet every day because you know because of the weather and then maybe some people love taking their duvet to the laundry and you know it's expensive so i told the lady to buy duvet cover for the mother because we bought even a duvet so this is a duvet cover it's king size are hey, you about to see okay it's so nice it isn't even have a zip not mattress mattress cover Duvet cover. You can even see the details. The details. Yeah, so this is a duvet cover. So this one I bought at 1500 Kenyan shillings. Let me tell you guys. This is the best thing ever to buy. Even me, I have it. It's the best thing ever. Reason being, washing the duvet all the time, you know, it is good. At a ukichafua a it is just this it's like a cloth you just go and wash it so it's 1500 kenyan shillings all sizes maybe like four by six you can at least bargain maybe it can be a thousand but this one it is 1500 kenyan shillings that is 15 dollars give or take it's so nice yani <laughs> I don't know it's it's really nice when i tell you something is nice and you know my my taste see i'm chesel and the color i think it's somehow gray gray kwambali or something and it's good because you know these things we are taking them to the village and you know in the village because of the matope raining all the time it's not like nairobi the way nairobi it's always dusty so because of of it's going to the village i told the lady this is the best choice to by so that it, she he or she can dress the duvet cover and then i bought pillowcases she told me her reference was dark colors not 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 so bright or not so dark, dark colors but at least not bright colors so i bought these two pillowcases 
and this one a pair was a hundred eh? which means each is 50 50 so this was a hundred and it's so nice it's cotton pure cotton pure cotton at the same time now by the way they're so nice this is a hundred i also bought i i bought almost four pairs yeah four pairs of uh pillowcases so this one and you see the way you just dress your pillow that's how do they cover and i can't even know how i'm going to explain this i think you've understood now the duvet cover so this is brown in color you see these are the best colors in in the village at the village not in the village at the village all these pillowcases i bought at a hundred a pair and i bought four pairs and the four pairs were 400 kenyan shillings hmm? and i also bought a gray okay because this one has a very good detail look at it and see this this aki it's good to have children who really care for you you know the thought the thought is what that counts eh you see look at the details and this and the pure cotton and i made sure you know the camera because i remember i went there at around 9 9 30 a.m i was already in the gikomba market so me nilikuwa chagua camera and you know you can always go to Gikomba and buy this stuff and resell them. It's only me in Kutumwa and Metumwa. But I think I'll start Ibiasharaya bed sheets. Because so far I've been I've been sent to buy bed sheets in Gikomba and then delivering them. I think I'll start this business. Uh, to resell them. Actually, I'm not going to open a bill. I think a bill for bed sheets, the best one cotton goes for four thousand Kenyan shillings. That is forty dollars give or take. And but it has many pieces, but me I prefer going and kuchagua moja moja, then I come and buy and sell to people. You can even do actually it's a very good, it's a business idea, guys. I'm giving you. You can go and buy because a piece is a hundred and you can go and sell at 200 Kenyan shillings. This is but for this I'm not selling, these are concierge services. And then so you see this bed sheets will go well. You know me, I thought it's not good to buy all the sheets dark colours. And the bed sheets were six. Uh, the size of the bed was six by six. So, so she told me to buy six by six. And these things me caught on. I'm so proud of myself. And you know, the good thing with him, I made sure that Unon Hapa, let me show you guys. Hapa, it was tight. Kuna zingine, there are some, you'll find that here is not tight. So when you try and make your bed, as it has shikilia, it will not touch well, you know. So it a bed when you wake up in the morning bed bed sheets you can. These are very good fitting bed sheets, guys. Hmm? We go to the next one. Let's go to the next one. Brown. Brown is a very good color. We shall go. Six by six. Is brown and you'll notice Aki when you send me to Gikomba you'll be very happy I made sure that uh, the edges they are very tight not loose very tight and I made sure that they don't have any dents like any dents so the next one is this is brown but not dark that dark brown this is another shade of brown it shade maybe it's goldish but it's another shade of brown and you can see i made sure this is six by six and it's very tight you know they try, they wanted to confuse me that it doesn't matter if it's not tight here or not elastic the elasticity is not tight but me i made sure you know when you send me i love people to love my work so also this is six by six <sighs> and then this is doing in another six by six this is gray Gray will go when the, there are some pillow covers, pillow cases there. When you need gray, as you can see, they are very tight. I bought five pairs, five pieces of bed sheet, fitting bed sheets. That's it, twelve fifty. Each bed sheet was going for two hundred and fifty Kenyan shillings, which makes it to be twelve fifty. That is twelve dollars, give or take. <coughs> And here are another pillowcase covers. Blue. Look at the details. 
blue pillowcase covers blue a hundred and this one will go with the brown with the brown nini with the brown bed sheet you can see let me show you the details i'm able to see the details so these are the details this one is not pure cotton it's a mix of cotton and silk as you can see and then this one aki this one Nilipenda. This one is a shade of brown, and you can see Nile Nzito. Nzito Kabisa. So you can see this is the inner part, and this is the outer part. And I also made sure that the elasticity is so tight. I bought these bed sheets at two different places because one place, ah, and both places were 250. Let me tell you the direction. Unano kingia paleki kumba paloko na kiyatu kiyatu You just go on a Peter family bank. And then after family bank, you just, there's a car. The first left turn, you just enter from there. Though, there are some places where they sell towels, benches, and everything. There you get everything. And then this one, I went to to Kamkunji. Uh, she wanted me I buy her light duvet. And you know these duvets, Siko For this one, I bought at 2500 And there's one for 1500 1500 one it's not binded that is and it's not good and it's long, long it's not long lasting the reason why this one is 2500 uh it's binded and hieraruki sana and it's six by six and i noticed i looked actually it after is a short karibu tano like six of them in giko in kombar in kankunji i know you say that i bought bright colors bright color but you know the good thing it has two sides it has this side and it has this other side but the good thing with this there's a duvet cover to tabalisha duvet cover to prevent it from getting any dirt of course we need to wash our duvets but not kill us because these things mean veto and you know sometimes the weather acts up that's why i i thought of buying a a very good duvet cover Kuivalisha he. I wish in Gekwani Mosha because this other thing, these other bed sheets and in are thrifted and this one is new. So it's a must we wash the thrifted bed sheets and the duvet cover. Ningewanyesha ni kivalisha he muone. And this duvet comes with came with uh, one sheet, one pair of sheet, this hundred percent cotton, and it's squared. Let me if it is to say kuzuia. 15 and some other two pillowcases so guys remember i told you there are two types of this duvet kuna 1500 which is in a raruka raka it's sort of it's not poor it's not good the person who i bought this uh, duvet from she told me that it's better i buy this binded one and this was the only one that had left the other one this was the only one remaining the other one was pink in color and I thought it was so bright. So I just chose this one. Night to Valisha Duvet. So that shop is in Mukore building. Second floor shop number 74. That's where I bought the, the, the duvet, guys. That is where I bought the duvet. For more info, just DM me on my email. And also I'm going to put my number there on the description box below. I hope you've enjoyed my try on haul. Now it's time to pack this stuff and deliver them to the owner. I'm so proud of myself. And you see the good thing with the new duvet? They come with their bags fully. So, <coughs> ah, voila. <laughs> or, pillowcase cover. So I hope you love this video. Give it, give it a like, share, subscribe, and guys, continue watching my channel. Make sure that you watch my videos from the start up to the end. Don't skip the ads. And always put your post notification bell on, which is on the left side. So when I post a video, it notifies you. And also, guys, please suggest which kind of videos you want me to post. And I'll do that. Let me end this video by appreciating you guys. I've 
reached 10,000 subscribers and I'm so happy. It is a, it has been hell of a ride. I'm really so happy with these tough times. I'm so happy guys reaching 10. Let's go road to 20,000 subscribers. Yes, and I really appreciate. So thank you so much. Thank you so much. I love you. See you in the next video. And for concierge services, make sure that you tell me because I'm Mama Plug. I'm that one person that makes sure I interact with my clients and I deliver 100%. If it is not 190%, at least what I can tell you guys, my clients are very happy when I do my work. Because most of them, I've never seen them in person. They just saw my video and they, it, they thought it was good to support me and to, to support my business, which I really, really appreciate you guys. So... Keep the jobs coming, guys. I'm here for you from furniture, from clothing, from everything. I'm here for you. I got you. Bye-bye. This is what we call binding. Binded, eh? Binded duvet. So, I hope you're able to see. I think that's the difference, eh? And at least it's... It's Mzito Kidogo. It's not light as compared to the other one. And the other one, you know, I noticed the bed sheet was not even cotton. It was kind of a mix of nylon and cotton, polyester and cotton. So this one is the best. So, bye-bye. So, by going back to school, to Mekuja Apa, they are selling these uh, two pieces at 500 cotton. <laughs> Why? Hi.